My first experience with trauma research, so to speak, happened when I was about six years old. At that time, my dad underwent the psychotherapy and I asked what this is all about. So he took a piece of paper and a pen and first he drew a smiley face and then he drew a sad face. And on the sad face, he indicated some sort of scars. And then he said that psychotherapy is aimed at undoing those scars and make him smile again. When you want to overcome a traumatic memory, then it's better to face it than to suppress it. And while this has been known in psychotherapy, at the level of the brain cells, we simply don't know what is happening. What we could now show for the very first time is that the key to a successful treatment of a trauma lies in the very same cells that used to store this trauma. And in the long run, we hope that this will have positive implications for the treatment of post-traumatic stress disorder. What happens with a mouse that is traumatized is that it doesn't move anymore. It's just scared. And what happens with a mouse that underwent the treatment for its trauma is that it resumes normal activity and walks around normally. Now what we can show is that the treatment of a traumatic memory is not mediated by two distinct memory traces, but it is rather an overwriting of the original memory trace of fear towards safety, which is happening. What we can see in this image are brain cells, and what we can see in green is a brain cell that was active when the mouse was still scared. After undergoing the treatment of its trauma, we also tagged the cells that were active when the mouse was no longer scared in red. And what is clearly visible from this image is that there is an overlap which stipulates that the same cells that were active when recalling a traumatic memory are also active when the mouse was no longer scared. Now we know what happens at the level of the brain cells. In the future we want to look inside those cells, at the genes, at the DNA, to see how a trauma and more importantly how a treatment of the trauma affects those genes. Thank <laughs> you.